Hi, Robin with Oxy Dry, and today I've got my first job of the day, uh, just one bedroom, and um, it's about 10 years or so old, and this particular carpet, uh, this is a nylon, I know it is, because <laughs> it's actually the same carpet I have in my mudroom. Um, it's a nice carpet, but it isn't a great wearing carpet, and you can see that um, the uh, pile has radically change in its appearance. It's really felting together and the texture, the pattern, the carpet just disappears fairly quickly. But, uh, and even though this is a bedroom, it's it's really flattened in the uh, traffic areas and you can see pooling and shading going on here. That's not dirty and clean. That's like just the way the, the pile is leaning one way or any other. Pile reversal, sometimes we call it. But uh, anyway, so just the one room. I vacuumed it all, did the edges and corners. I've actually cleaned behind the uh, bedside tables and uh, put them back. And uh, so now we'll do the main area. And won't take very long, I guess. <laughs> and I've got a uh, hog's hair fiber pad on there. And that will help to lift that pile, separate the iron a little bit. Can't unwear it, of course, but it's going to look fine. It's, it cleans well, this carpet. <coughs> this one isn't actually visibly soiled, I wouldn't say. But mind you, it's a color that does hide the soil well. And cleaning with uh, Nanomax, two ounces per gallon. And there's CLO2 in the solution as well. <clears throat> so we're including the sanitizing, deodorizing, anti allergen treatment. And the uh, Nanomax, of course, has the uh, plant based AFT anti resoiling protector in it. So that's all part of the process and cleaning. I'm in an area of Kelowna called West Kelowna, which uh, is actually across the bridge. There's a, a bridge across the lake, Okanagan Lake, right at Kelowna, and on the other side of the bridge from Kelowna, which we call it West Side or West Kelowna. Because it's the west side of the lake. This is a uh, gated community. Quite a few houses in here. They're, I think, almost all individual houses. Not, I don't think there's any. I think there might be a few townhouses in here, but most, or duplexes even, but most of them are individual houses. So. Pretty high end uh, area here. You can see how convenient it is having the light on the machine. I'm able to see quite well, even though there is a light in this closet. It doesn't really uh, work very well at giving adequate light for cleaning, but with this nice bright halogen or LED light on there, it does make a big difference. You don't want halogen. <laughs> you get off heat like crazy. You can see really serious uh, power reversal going on right here. The, the panel leaning one way and then leaning the other way. That's what that um, weird looking dark spot is. It's not soiling. Okay, we're going to switch over to uh, Iron Man.
Hmm. A tricycle. <laughs> small really actually a pretty small day today I think the next job is only two rooms and then another job a little bit later not very big either but uh, I did a big uh, condo unit a few days ago or a building pardon me hallways and stairways I did record it and then I accidentally uh, I used the vibe and I but I accidentally um, uh, erased the recording before I uploaded it Got a little more carried away <laughs> with hitting uh, I was getting rid of some stuff on my phone and the phone and I didn't realize that I had actually selected that particular video and hit the um, delete <laughs> so anyway cleaned up really well see the pile of distortion along here as well that's just the power reversal cannot be undone okay let's uh, take a look at the pad Not actually that soiled, but I'm going to flip it. And uh, work my way out with the B side. Give it a bit more drying. Because I'm going to post back to that immediately here. Because it's uh, the one room. I want to make sure the carpet is uh, dry enough that I can run the vacuum on it. I could groom it, but... I'm going to vacuum this one, I think. Because generally, that um, bedrooms are, you know, they do tend to have a lot of dust in the carpet. Because, uh, well, partly because of uh, when people are changing their sheets, you get a lot of cotton dust off the sheets. And there's a more skin, obviously. And people tend to not vacuum the bedrooms very often compared to the rest of the house, forgetting that they really should be vacuuming the bedroom all the time. <laughs> you think, well, I'm not in there very much, but they actually are. So, we'll head over this way a little bit. portion here.
Yeah, there's virtually nothing on the B side, which is what I expected. Chuck that out there. Get it out of the way. I put a, a rag under the um, machine because it drips. Okay, we'll go the post vacuuming. Yeah, carpet's just slightly damp. Just fine. Okay. Mm -hmm. So you can see that weird looking line there. That's where the pile changes direction. And we call that pile reversal or cooling and shading. And it's a permanent uh, effect that happens on some carpets, not all carpets. But uh, you can't undo that. Looking good, other than the wear. But, uh, not bad. From start to finish, not counting the pre-vacuuming. 15 minutes. Okay, there you go. Let you go. Thank you for watching and have a good day.